So I go over here to my Postman instance, and I'm starting in the Request Builder. Uh, and I go over here to Request History, and this has a list of all of the requests I've written, I've run in uh, a chronological order. What I can do if I wanted to run one of these requests again is I could look through my Request History and find it and select it. Um, let's see if I wanted to run this one again. I could select it. It would pop up here. This is an endpoint that returns random numbers. It takes two parameters, uh, number of bytes to return, and the format, the D in this case, is decimal. So what I could do is go over to the request history, select the request, and run it again. And it would, uh, I get the body and all of the details down here. Sometimes what I want to do is find and save requests in collections to make it easier for me to use them and share them. So in this case, I, what I can do is take this request and save it into a collection. It showed up right here in my request history because I just sent it. I can save this request two places uh, into a collection. I can either do it here over in the history request tab, or I can go over here in the request um, builder itself. I'm going to go ahead and select this request and save it to a collection. I'm going to save it into a collection called a random number collection and save it. And then when I go to my collections tab, what I'll see there is a new collection, in this case with that one request. If I wanted to create another one, um, let's use this same endpoint and two different parameters, number of bytes maybe being 64, and let's use format of H, which stands for hexadecimal. I can send the request, and let's say I wanted to save that too. Again, I can save it a couple places over here. I can save it in the request. In this case, it has the request name. I can add a description, um, 64 bytes of And I'm going to save it to an existing collection, my A random number collection, and save it. And then now what you'll see over here is that I have two requests in my collection. Collections are great um, because you can share them with folks. Um, you can add doc a description. Um, you will be able to put variables and tests in there. It's a great format for everything you want to do with an API. Thanks.